I said yes, sir, yes, sir, y'all. I'm back in Carolina, evoking as I roll through like old times. Well, we didn't know when he exactly started boxing because he uh, was boxing in uh, college in Southern Virginia. And um, when we found out about it, I thought it was something that he just wanted to do, you know, just to do, not get real serious with it. He didn't want us to know because mm -hmm. he knew we were probably been against it. So he did a little bit in Southern Virginia. And then by the time he got down here, we found that he was boxing. So what could we do? Wayne plays this by he play basketball, uh play football. I uh, he didn't do too much baseball, you know, uh did a lot of running, flipping. He just made he basically made sports out of everything. Very competitive guy. I saw he was missing out on uh utilizing the power and the strength that he that he has as just a natural athlete. And I think he was won a lot of fights on pure athleticism. Um so when he came to us, I mean, the biggest thing that we done so far is, you know, helping him with his balance. Uh, we've helped him with the placement of power shots. Uh, we've helped him to uh, train his eyes to notice how a fighter is also reacting to punches you throw so that he's not just throwing punches. Um, so I think we, we've definitely polished him up a, a little bit and made him more crisp and, uh, and really getting him ready for the next level. It's, it is so great to see him focus on something and finishing it out. And I told him the other day how proud I was of him. He picked something and just went for it because he just wants greatness. And not just for himself, but for his family, his friends. I would sit down on um, medical field and, and I see a lot of things and, and all I can do is pray. And this ain't what I want him to get into, but when they grown, they grown. I can't, you know. But I'm still behind him, cause he love it. It's making him happy. I, I think Dwayne could be fighting for a title, um, honestly, within two years, if we keep him busy. Uh, with the weight division that he's in, uh, the lower weight, a lot of times those, those titles are, are vacated. Uh, but just because they're vacated doesn't mean that there's not some serious competition and uh, fighters within that division. In terms of the title seeking, and that's fine. You know, more important, I want him to be home. You know, I, I rather, I want Demon to be just appreciative of the hard work that this team that puts in him, uh, just be supportive of others. Uh, and we will continue to support Demon as long as he continues to give us and give himself a hundred percent effort. Uh, with, with that determination, the motor that he has and the skill set that he has, this kid can definitely go to the top. Like Coach said, within two years, he should be fighting for a title. The kid is, is phenomenal. He's one heck of an athlete. And uh, I just don't see anything getting in Beeman's way but Beeman. So uh, we're going to give it our all. Watch out. Here we come. Looking out the plane, down on the city, brake lights looking like blood in the vein. Uh -huh. Block after block, the traffic jam crazy, stopping up the flow like cholesterol, baby. And it amazed me.